Hello and welcome back to Vixen Purple's Crochet and More. I'm your host Cheryl. Today is Saturday, November 18th. Today is about 60 degrees, maybe plus or minus, depending on what the weather wants to do with itself. It's a sunny outside. It's not snowing, so that's a good thing for me. So yeah, today I've got lots of life things going on. I've got house to cleaning to do, and I wanted to pop in and say hi and show you guys a very small Hirschner's order that I had placed, I believe, on November 11th. At least that's what my paperwork says. Anyhow, um, I've already talked to, I already said some stuff that I was going to probably do a small order. Um, some of these are going to be the same things that I showed you on previous hauls. Um, these are the Speckle, and there's two new, two different ones in there that I well, the same brand, but two different colorways that I got that I'd like, thought I'd try. Anyhow, with no further ado, I wanted to show you the size of the box here. I do apologize. So it's not too bad. It's a, it's like I said, it's a small box. So, sorry guys, I didn't mean to bump you. So there were some colorways that I wanted to get extra of, and I did, and I got the, the worsted speckles in the blue color. What is it called? Let me see. This is called Raindrops. And I had purchased one ball. And I liked how, how it looked. And it's really soft. I've been working with the purple one. Um, and I just like how it's got a squish factor on it. And uh, it's really soft. So I picked up two more of the blue. I picked up two more of the purple. And the purple is called purple purple parade okay and it's the Hirschner Hirsch, Hirschner's worsted um, eight speckles or Hirschner's worsted specks yarn I can't speak today so I got two of the purple two of the blue and then I picked up uh, two more of the color called beach glass which is a tealy with a dark teal in there on that so I picked up two more of those and while I was on the site I wanted to see what I their heather they had some heathers and it's called Hirschner's Heather worsted heathers sorry I can't speak today so this is the colorway deep sea and it's a well it's showing up purple in my camera but it's not here let me shut this off so you guys can see there we go so that's it's pretty much true to color is the gray and like white mixed into it it's really soft so i wanted to try it now this has got the same amount of yardage as the uh, specs as well as the other stripes and their other worsted weight. It is um, 8 ounces, 226 grams, 489 yards, 448 meters. And it is a worsted weight 4. So I got two of the heathers, or two of the deep sea, which is the grays. And then I picked up two of the purple colored heather and it's called M mystic and this is more of the purple and it's pretty true to color but i thought i would try it see how i liked it and like i said it's really really soft and i can't complain so i wanted to try them while i was there i also picked up two bags of the because they have them in the uh their super saver red heart super savers in the in bags and the bags were for eight dollars and 97 cents i picked up two of the claret let me show you what it looks like so, and it was a bag of three, 
for eight dollars for eight ninety seven. So basically nine dollars a ball or nine dollars a bag for so that's three dollars a ball for or skein for seven ounces, three hundred and sixty four yards, and it's a hundred percent acrylic. This is called Chloret. Turn the light on so you guys can see the, the light. There we go. The name. There it is. And that's pretty pretty close to true to color, except for it's a little bit redder on this, but it's really, really soft for that. So I picked up six balls, so two bags for that price as well. So that is kind of it on what um, I bought from Hershner's yarn. So, um, and I just wanted to show you, let me know what you think of the Heathers and whether the uh, Red Heart Super Saver, uh, three, ba three for nine bucks basically, is worth a good deal. I think it is. It's not a bad. And um, go from there. Um, just to let you guys know, I have been a very bad girl, but I can say I have justification because November is my birthday month and I decided to buy me some birthday yarn. <laughs> so I have a couple of other orders coming. So one is going to be a Mary Maxim order. Um, I know I bought two mystery bags so I'm gonna I wanted to see what they were having in because I've seen other people show them I know uh, Crystal from Bag of Day has showed them and I just wanted to see what I would get I know each person is different I know some things sometimes they're good bags sometimes they're not great bags but they're still a mystery and it's kind of fun um, I also was uh, I got an email from Premier Yarns the other day and they said they were having a Black Friday sale. And I'm like going, okay, well, at first I wasn't going to buy. But then I was like, okay, well, you know, some of these things are really good. There was some yarns in there that I've been wanting to get and try. So, yeah, I went on to their, um, their um, <laughs> Black Friday sale. That's what it is called, Black Friday sale. And they had uh, some yarns for a dollar, some yarns for two dollars, some yarns for three dollars, four dollars, and five dollars. And um, I got a little bit of a mixture. So I just wanted to let you guys know that that's on its way. I ordered it today, which is the 18th. So I'm hoping that I could have it back by the time my birthday comes around, um, which is at the end of the month. Um, so yeah. <laughs> so anyhow... I just wanted to show you guys what was happening, what I, what I purchased. Let me know what you guys think. And in the meantime, I'm going to say hello and uh, big hugs from me to you uh, from Colorado Springs, Colorado, where I reside. And I hope you guys have a great weekend. Also, this is going to be the um, Thanksgiving week. So happy Thanksgiving to you all. I hope you have a wonderful day with your family and friends. It's always fun to get together when you have um, a nice big fat meal to go with it. Um, we're probably going to keep it on the down small on the downside for me, and because basically everybody is either out of state or someplace else and haven't figured out what they're going to do. So I may get a three day weekend. I don't know. I just have to see what's going to play. I may go in for a half a day um, to work and on Friday, but I haven't crossed that bridge yet, but we'll see what's happening. Um, I do have some pumpkins upstairs that I need to actually make pumpkin puree puree. I actually, a little bit about me, I actually make my own, um, pumpkin puree. I go and buy the big old jack-o'-lanterns and I do the things that I need to do to get them cooked down and chopped up and ready for my uh, pumpkin breads when I make them, pumpkin pies when I make them. And honestly, I think my pies turn out a lot better when I make my own puree, along with um, my 
my pumpkin breads and stuff. So yeah, that's what I get to do here in the next couple of days is get that taken care of so I can start making some breads. But anyhow, you guys, I hope you have a wonderful Thanksgiving holiday. And as soon as my other orders come in, oh, by the way, my Mary Maxim order should be here Monday. So you guys may get a video Thursday for Thanksgiving. Or I don't know yet. <laughs> we'll figure that out. But I should be getting that what, Mary Maxim order Monday. At least that's what my tracking said that I was going to get. So with that being said, you guys have a wonderful, wonderful weekend and upcoming holidays and Thanksgiving. So you have a great day and I will talk to you soon. Bye for now.